All right, gamers, I've got some pretty sad news. As you might have figured, I lost the recording footage to the Lunchables. So sadly, I hyped everything up in the last episode for nothing. But in this video, we're actually going to get pretty far and possibly get to the Elite Four in this one. But basically, you just want to grab this guard spec real quick. You want to use your brutal strength to do this. You want to push the boulder out of the way. And of course, welcome back, guys, to a brand new video on the channel. Welcome back to, you know, Pokemon Fire Red. If you guys do want to enjoy this video, please leave a like. If you like, make sure to support. Press the subscribe button if you're new. Follow me on all my social medias and subscribe below. So, Instagram, Twitter, Discord, and Twitch, second channel, and podcast. And um, I think I might be stuck in this battle. Actually, no, I'm not. I can use my troll. As long as he doesn't get me with like a attack that does like 500 plus damage. Vital throw. Okay, that shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, that's not too bad. Okay, we can use wing attack. Hopefully take him out. Kind of hesitated there, so I thought he was going to miss. It's not something I want to see. How is he alive? That's what I want to know. Is how on earth is this guy alive? Jeez. I'm about to get beat by him a choke, my guy. Come on. Alright, well, let me use a hyper potion. Alright, so now what you want to do is you want to, you know, just kind of take a look around and you want to go down. Crap, I did too far. Oh, no. Oh, no, my friend. I went too far. Um, basically what I was doing this entire um, Let's Play for the last few episodes was just kind of um, just making sure we can get all the items. Now, in this episode, I'm actually going to be escaping the cave. So that's kind of what we're going to be doing right now. So what you want to do is avoid ladders at all costs and av avoid Pokemon at all costs. Alright, we're going to push this one into that little hole right there or the whatever you want to call that we already fought that guy so now we are going to go this way and we're gonna go get a ball and we can actually go up this ladder there's certain ladders that you don't want to go up and down um, so I want to try to get to here go around Oh, right. Sorry, I'm kind of stupid. Um, you want to take this boulder and go put it in the hole all the way over there. So, be sure to do that. I'm going to skip ahead from that. Alrighty. So, we knock that thing over here. Go up. Go down, down, down. Go here, and boom. Very nice. Let me put a new rappel on. And we'll go get the other boulder real quick. Very nice. Boom. Look at how fast we be rolling dough. Um, please. Thank you. Now, it does look like it disappeared. Just trust me on the fact that it didn't. Do we fight these guys? No, we did not. Let's fight these guys real quick. Okay, so cool trainer Colby Kingler. Okay, do not have the right Pokemon for this. Um, not very handy. So we're going to switch out if the game will let me, please. Thank you. Switch over to Bolt. He's the best uh, best Pokemon I got against Water at the moment. I probably should have gotten a Leaf, but it's okay. Like I said, I beat the game on my other accounts. Actually, I did beat the game with a uh, Pikachu, so it's nice. Thunder really came in clutch and um, all that stuff, so hopefully we can beat, you know, the uh, Elite Four. It's broke something. Nice. Okay. So, we've defeated the Kingler. Polyworld. 
If these if this guy is like all water types, um, I'll probably just skip ahead real quick. Real quick, um, I don't know if you guys can see this very well. But this is like air freshener stuff. And they look like candy. And I just stuck my finger in them and did like this with them. And now my hand smells like bathrooms at like public restaurants. I don't like this. Well, anyways, we got a tentacle, and I'm just going to quickly use a thunderbolt on him. Or go into my bag. Got to chase the bag with non-Pokemon fights. So we are at 3 out of 15 um, power points. Or, yeah, power points is what it's called. Um, so I got to use an ether properly pretty soon. Bubble Beam. That is the stupidest name for a move ever. Not even gonna lie. Ooh. Alright, hopefully we get a critical or something here. Because we might die. Oh my god, let's go, dude. Oh no. We got a fellow Blastoise. Wow. Rest in peace, brother. I love you. I love you, Blastoise. But sadly, you gotta go. Peace. But that does not kill. How does that not kill? Oh my god, I'm gonna die now. I'm actually gonna... Oh, he's gonna use Rain Dance. Okay. Don't worry, guys. He's an idiot. Don't worry. Now, I'm probably going to use a move here that's gonna be a little bit weaker to, you know... Save the chances of Thunder actually not, you know, working. And he's probably going to use a heal. Ooh. Lucky, lucky, lucky. This could kill. This could kill. Let's go. Sorry. Faint. I'm sorry, YouTube. Um, I probably should not be saying that. The K word right now. And, um, you know, judging by how YouTube is at the moment. So I probably should not be saying that. But anyways, we defeated this trainer. We got one more trainer to take on. And then we should be able to uh, escape. Alrighty. And the next trainer will take her on. Um, yeah. We'll take her on. Sorry. Pokemon is very weird sometimes. And it's pretty hard to tell sometimes like what gender a character is. But this one's for sure a girl. I mean, unless it's a guy named Caroline, which if you're if you're a guy and your name is Caroline, I'm sorry, but you got to go seek some medical help, my guy, because that is just yikes, my dude. If you're a guy named Caroline, please comment in the comments right now and tell me that your name is Caroline, and I'll pin your comment. If your name is not Caroline and you're not a guy, I'll still pin your comment. I really have no way of knowing. If you are not, but um, I'll pin your comment, so be sure to leave a funny comment in the comments. I want to kill myself. Um, Alright, so secret power, we'll use that. Apparently I ran out of power points on that move too. Wow, okay, secret power is actually really good, and they flinched. And so you know what happens when you flinch? You get ditched. Never mind. Carolina, you know, our favorite... Pokemon guy, apparently. Caroline. Is, uh, you know, just gonna use a uh, Hyper Potion real quick. And it's okay, though, because he probably has another one up his sleeve. No, he doesn't. Very nice. My heater just turned on, and it feels very good. It's probably not the greatest sense I've set on this channel. I just realized that this is not in full screen. My bad. <laughs> It's not really even in full screen anyways. It's just, you know, weirdness. All right, let me uh, use a... What's the uh, thing that I literally just... Is it the elixir? Do I even have one? Do, 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 do. Please tell me I have one. Oh, Max Ether. There we go. There we go, my deed. Flamethrower. And now we should be able to take out the victory bell. Like that. Actually, I think I was so fast on that you couldn't see it on the camera. Ready? Like that. 
All right, well, um, all we have to do is use a, a good old flamethrower on this plant. And we should have this in the bag. Or they're going to use acid on me. Amazing. I love being toxidized, but I'm paralyzed, so I cannot be poisoned. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's facts. If you're poisoned, you cannot be paralyzed or, you know, iced, um, which ice is a thing that you're going to see in later videos. Uh, you can't be burned. I don't think, um, so you just have to be one of those. So if I'm anything, I would rather be, oh, and sleep, sorry. But if you're asleep, I'm pretty sure you can get poisoned if you're asleep. Um, but what would you guys be? If you guys could be any of those in the game for eternity, what would you be? I would rather be paralyzed because it's a very slim chance that you're actually going to be not able to attack. But sometimes it can screw your match over, sometimes it can't. And as of right now, it doesn't look like it's screwing me over, so I think we're doing pretty good. But uh, yeah, we just took out Parasect. Once again, we could have a level 47 pretty soon. Probably next battle. Probably? Possibly. Very likely. I'll probably name this uh, video uh, Minecraft Cave Exploration Escaping the Caves Part 365. It's probably what I'll name this video. I think that's a pretty good title. You know, the longer the better. It goes for a lot of things in life. Alright, Flamethrower. And we should have a level 47 Lawrence at the end of this. Police. There we go. Nice, we took him out. We should have a level 47. Police. And boom, level 47. Lawrence, and he's probably going to learn Leer. Okay. No, I don't want to learn a, a move for Leer. If you don't know what Leer is, it just... I think it lowers your opponent's defense or attack or something, but it basically is like lure. It's stupid. Um, but yeah. Next thing you want to do. Push this. Oh. Push that into the hole. Drop down into thy hole. And you want to. This is how you escape, by the way. So. You want to use your strength. And you want to push the boulder all the way over here. Let me get on my bike because it's a little bit faster. Yes, guys, we can push things on a bike. Yeah, I heard it here first on this YouTube channel. And you go up here, up through here. Thank you to Geneva or um, Samantha. Also could have been Miss Mike. It was one of the females that comments on my YouTube channel. But thank you for reminding me about how to escape in this game. So this is actually a double battle. And I'm just going to assume the worst um, possible. And I'm going to go for this. And let's do a double battle. I'm assuming it's probably going to be Leaf and probably Fighting. I only got magic out for the XP. You guys know how I am. Who you got? Right, you're Nido King and Nido Queen. I am the big slow. Um, all right, well, so we should have a pretty fair matchup, anyways. Um, so yeah, wing attack. We'll use it on the Nido Queen, and we'll use psychic on the Nido King. Hopefully, that does some damage. Not a whole lot of damage, but did some damage. Not gonna lie. So Nido King and Nido Queen. Jesus Christ. R.I.P. the King. Huh. The King killed the King. I killed the King. I am officially the King. I know the YouTube comments are happy now because for some reason they keep calling me a King. Don't ask why. I really don't know. Um, also, Brandon said he's going to be really active on this stuff. So, Brandon, if you're seeing this, what's up? I'm sure they're calling you Prince Charming in the comment section right now. So, uh, if you guys have made it this far in the video, comment, Brandon is a bot. And comment that 
uh, to show me that you made it this far in the video. So once again, if you made it this far in the video, comment Brandon is a bot, B-O-T. If you don't know how to spell Brandon, the YouTube comment section will tell you. Well, anyways, we defeated, off, uh, I just said officer. We just defeated Ray and whatever the other girl's name is, or I don't even know. Uh, but we're going to leave through here. Apparently, we already fought that guy. And now we have escaped Victory Road. Um, and quickly, though, um, am I? No, I haven't made it to the Indigo Plateau yet. So basically, you want to go up this way. We want to go up this way and repel effect war off. That's okay. We won't need it. Welcome, guys, to the final area of the game. So what I like to do during this, you know, scenario, guys, is I like to fly to the Pokemon Mansion. Now hear me out. Um, you also have to get to that building. I don't think you have to go in it, but you have to get to that building in order to fly back to it. Heal your Pokemon really quickly. I like going to the mansion because I'm pretty sure it's like, you know, one of the farthest away places. But yeah, what you... What you want to do, guys, is you want to go to the store, and you want to just stock up on everything that you know and can find and will do. Because I'm blue. da ba dee da ba die You want to make... Um, I'll get about 12. You're going to use way more than 20 potions. Um, at least I do. Revive. We already got about 20 in the bag. I'll buy five more just to be on the safe side. As you guys can see, you got to have a lot of money for, money to be able to do this, guys. All right, and I think we're good. Full heal. I'll buy a few full heals just in case, boys. You never know what could happen. And as you can see, we're now sitting at 84K. I had a million in the bank, and I spent all my money on things to stock up in this game. And guys, I think in the next episode, we will be taking on the Elite Four. And hold up, what episode is this? This will be episode 68. So, 69, we'll fight the Elite Four. And episode 70 will be the final video. So, yeah, guys, be sure to tune in to Wednesday's video, hopefully. Where we will take on the Elite Four. My gosh, guys. It's going to be crazy. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you guys are going to enjoy it, please leave a like on the video. Press subscribe if you're new. Follow me on all my social medias and search below. Instagram, Twitter, Discord, and Twitch. Second channel and podcast. Here's the levels of what I have before I enter the Pokemon League. It's a pretty nice even number. Except for Magic. I might train him off screen and I might train Rocky off screen where they're... About level 47. Most of the trainers are going to be about level 50. I beat them on my alt account at level 40. But yeah, we'll come in and explore this building in just a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean next episode. Yeah. So yeah, guys. See you guys next time. Love you guys so much. And dude, we are so close to two more episodes. Two more episodes, guys. Two more episodes. They might even be a live stream.